And, you know, it's light and thin, so I like the material. It's meant to kind of match the underwear, which I think it does pretty well, but also to complement this apron, which is kind of like a half apron. And I really like the colors on this one. I think it looks very awesome. It that complements the rest of the strawberry uh, decor. Running with the strawberry theme, I also got this bra, which has a bunch of strawberries all over it and matching green straps, just like the uh, apron. And then to match that, I have some strawberry panties, which just have strawberries all over. Actually, I am still waiting on the underwear for this one. It is going to be some purple lingerie. For the sake of showing this off, I am going to be wearing the strawberry underwear from the other option, just because, you know, I think it kind of matches the fruit. This one's got some strawberries on it too, but I will be letting you guys know what this outfit looks with. Um, pattern of feathers, I suppose. It kind of looks like feathers in my opinion, but yeah it also has a pocket one singular down the middle so you know useful no dual pockets but that's okay and then to go along with this outfit i have this beige underwear here which consists of this shirt with some strappies along the top and i think the shirt by itself looks pretty dang cool but um yeah so this apron actually the way you take it off is just this one simple little button on the side and then you can remove the thing by uh pulling it over your head so i think the design for it is simple and kind of cute the one little pocket i think is too small to be useful but i guess we will see and going along with this i also got this uh one piece on this apron so kind of self-explanatory on that carrots everywhere and along with this i also got some lingerie that kind of matches it's a little bit more like redder pinker than the carrots on the apron but it's still pretty dang orange the clasp bra that's adjustable and then the bottom is also just a different type this turkey apron and this like um i wanted to get some kind of strappy looking brown lingerie but they didn't have any so these are technically swimsuits but they do have that like braided ropey design that i was looking for so i really like these and I am going to wear this outfit with these shoes with a little bit of gold in them. And it has some olives on it and some lettuce, maybe cabbage. One of those two, I forgot. And of course all these like swirly designs. And this apron, actually you have to tie the back um, up. It's not, it's not a straight in the middle it's one on each side for your boobs and then it has on the top and then the entire thing has a brown uh, skirt underneath with a little um, not sure what that's called vine design on them and then flowers in a smaller apron on top of that and then all around it has this sash with a bunch of turkeys on it that just a teal color they could also come in a pink color but i wanted to mix it up a bit so yeah i think the color looks nice on this one and they are very stretchy and breathable and i also got these gloves to kind of pull the outfit together and give it an accessory just because I thought these gloves were kind of interesting, where they only, that I thought looked kind of fun. You know, it's really colorful. It'll definitely stand out. 
Um, I was thinking for this one, just like the name of the shorts, I was gonna go jogging or running. Um, and that's where I was kind of going with this one. Or maybe boxing, you know? Something where I'm, which is actually a little weird, because I could have swore that this one came in, like, in a mixture of colors, but, oh well. Anyway, it's the same design as the top, and it has an elastic top, of course. And for this outfit, it's probably good for hiking. Might do running in this one, too. Might overheat running in this one. I guess we'll mostly see and the colors match and all that. And then to finish off the outfit, I got this skirt that I thought would look really cute on top of the pants. And I was hoping to wear all of these doing some archery, which is why I have, you know, the tight shirt with the thumb hole so that it doesn't, and I'm, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna roll with it. And then I also got this glove, singular glove, because for this outfit, I was hoping to do some type of golfing photo shoot, and I put together what I thought would be a golfing outfit. Of course, I'm not a uh, shirt. And basically the look that I was going for with this one was like traditional looking, just the, the sleaziest bowler that you can think of because I wanted to do a bowling photo shoot with this outfit. Um, and I wanted to have, you know, the gold color that we And it is a micro top. And this bottom is a, I don't know, bikini bottom? It doesn't seem like a micro. Well, no more so than most Wicked Weasel things, but it has like two straps, so this leads me to believe that this one is probably just their bikini bottom. And I got the micro version of this, and it has these cherry designs with some black dots on them, and of course the micro is Mostly string because it's Wicked Weasel. Same thing for the top, I got the micro top as well. This one doesn't have one of their little Wicked Weasel tags on them. But yeah, my top is pink and her bottoms are pink. It'll be like, we'll each have our own colors. I have the yellow one here. It is the micro design, mostly string, but it does have the tag on the front. And for the top, it is adjustable with a small micro touch taped it right here and I was starting to get something formed out. It was starting to look pretty good but then the tape ripped and uh, yeah it, it just ripped the rest of the material. Apparently you are not supposed to use decorative door frames as a dress. So this was a bus, but luckily for us, we have a bunch more trinkets to make another outfit with. And all right, so first I gotta take this off. Okay, I hope that's not in frame. And then I'm gonna need this one, and uh, and then I'll just use this as a skirt. All right, guys. So I think I've done it now. And oh, I got stuff stuck to my foot. That's okay. Ta-da! Because what's a banner? Then a fringe dress, huh? And as you can see, I actually lost a couple letters, so now I only have the P and a Y, so. Oh, I actually lost the letter A, too. So, P. 
New Year, guys. And if you're wondering why I got these uh, hats right here. <laughs> All right, so I think I made that work. <laughs> Who said you can't use party favors as clothing, right? All right, guys, so again, if you would want me to send you a custom little Happy New Year's photo, you can go ahead and pledge over on my Patreon as a doer of stuff 4X Plus and request one on my Discord. But otherwise, that's all I got for you for now. So get out there, do all the stuff, and I'll see you next year. Bye!